Prince Philip's funeral, nervous royal aides on eggshells amid Harry and William Rift. Royal sources have said the reported feud between Prince Harry and Prince William has taken up much thought and energy in preparation for Prince Philip's funeral today. The Duke of Edinburgh died peacefully last week aged 99 at Windsor Castle as the longest-serving royal consort in British history. Prince Philip's funeral will take place on Saturday in St George's Chapel in Windsor. Details released by the palace on Thursday confirm that Harry and William will be walking apart at their grandfather's funeral. The two dukes will be separated by their cousin Peter Phillips as the family walk behind the coffin of Prince Philip on Saturday. A palace spokesman said, This is a funeral, we're not going to be drawn into those perceptions of drama, or anything like that, this is a funeral. The arrangements have been agreed, and they represent Her Majesty's wishes, so we're not going to say anything more on that. Sources have insisted that the order of those walking behind Prince Philip's coffin was based on bloodlines and age. A royal source told the Daily Mail, Everyone is walking on eggshells so as not to exacerbate the situation. To be fair, both William and Harry have made clear that they wish to focus on mourning their grandfather and do not want anything to get in the way of that. But it has made everyone doubly nervous about saying anything that could be remotely construed of being critical of the other side. It's been a minefield. The group walking behind the coffin will be led by the Duke's two elder children, Prince Charles, 72 and Princess Anne, 70, who will walk side by side. They will be followed by Prince Andrew, 61, and Prince Edward, 57. Prince Philip's three adult grandchildren will be next, Prince William, 38, Peter Phillips, 43, and Prince Harry, 36. Although Princess Anne's son Mr. Phillips is older than the Duke of Cambridge, he is not a direct heir to the throne. Vice Admiral Sir Tim Lawrence and the Earl of Snowdon will follow behind the three men. Prince Philip's staff will make up the rest of the group at the rear end. Meghan Markle, who is pregnant, will not join her husband in returning to the UK following advice from her doctor not to travel. A source close to the Duchess of Sussex told E! News that Meghan would have attended the funeral if she were not heavily pregnant. They said the Sussexes are still not on amazing terms with the family. The source added, Meghan wishes she could have flown to the UK to support her husband but has been advised not to due to her pregnancy. She would have put all the family tension aside to be there with Harry. Harry wants to make sure Meghan and the baby are healthy and not involved in stressful situations. wishes she could have flown to the UK to support her husband but has been advised not to due to her pregnancy. She would have put all the family tension aside to be there with Harry. Harry wants to make sure Meghan and the baby are healthy and not involved in stressful situations.